Hey guys, Adriana Jimenez with Fino Boxing, he joined here with WBO champ Maurice Hooker. Maurice, big unification fight this Saturday night on the zone, uh, unifying titles against WBC champ Jose Ramirez at your hometown. How excited are you to put this great show on Saturday night? Uh, it's, it's a dream come true. I'm very excited and uh, I worked extra hard just for this fight. You're finally fighting at home. You went over to the UK. You traveled throughout the US and now you get to defend and potentially unify titles. How special is this opportunity for you? It's special because I get everybody in Dallas, Texas come and witness the greatness and you know, watch me win a, a world title, another world title, but this world title will be more special because everybody can beat her. You know, my last, world, I mean, my uh, first world title, I was in England, nobody get to see it, but now everybody come and, and watch and support it. Yeah. Fighting here at home, you have your friends, you have your family. How have you handled that pressure of having them um, leading up to the fight, just having them around you? Sometimes they help, sometimes it can be a little bit of distracting. How have you handled that pressure? I, really, I don't have that many friends, you know. I don't answer numbers I don't know. I don't test numbers I don't know. And uh, I, I just have a couple of friends, you know. They just haven't been distracted. They don't call. They know what time it is. They know it's, it's a time for me to go to work, and they really don't call. But well, we've seen the boxer, we've seen the puncher, we've seen different sides of you. What can we expect to see from you Saturday night? A lot, a lot of, a lot of action, a lot of, a lot of right hands and left hooks. I mean, you don't want to miss this fight. It might end early. <laughs> what you predicted? Um, did you predict a certain round? No, no, I didn't pre predict a certain round, but. I, I don't see it going the whole 12, but the style he, Jose is, the, yeah. the style he has and the style I have. What do you expect to see from him? Uh, I know he coming. He, he's, he's a straightforward fighter. He come to fight and uh, he come to swing and uh, I just have to be ready for him. With the victory over Jose Ramirez on Saturday, do you feel that puts you on the top of the 140 division? Or do you feel that you, need, you still would need to face the winner between Regis Progre and Josh Taylor? Uh, it would put me on top. I'd be number one in 140, but I just want to be the best, and I, and I would like to fight the winner at the uh, tournament. Yeah, okay. Yeah. 140 is obviously, there's so much talent, but there's also a lot of talent, one division up 147. Do you ever envision yourself moving up to 147? Uh, right now, I'm, I don't think about that. Uh, right now, just fuck his own, just win this title yeah. Saturday. But, but if I had to, I will. Yeah. Well, in 147, we have Manny Pacquiao, who just recently fought this weekend against Keith Thurman, beating a 10-year ten, ten younger Keith Thurman in his prime. Did you happen to see that fight? Yes, it was a good fight. I actually was going for Keith Thurman because he was younger yeah. and he had power, but he been out for a while. How surprised were you, especially with the knockdown in the very first round? Man, I was surprised. Like, man, Pacquiao still heavy. I thought he you know, might lose a little speed and power, but he still heavy. <laughs> yeah. Do you think that he can still compete, that Benny Pacquiao can compete with, um, let's say, the winner between Errol Spence and Sean Porter? Yes, yes, I, I do. I mean, he, have, he haven't lost it. I mean, he's, he, he's still one of the, the best out there. Yeah, yeah. That fight between um, Spence and Porter, who do you think will come out victorious that night? Uh, I had to go with uh, Spence, man. We're both from Dallas. And uh, he's the better fighter, the better puncher. And uh, it, it's a good fight, but Spence will win by knockout. So then if Spence fights Manny Pacquiao, do you think Spence beats Pacquiao? I had to go with Spence again because he's from <laughs> Dallas. I just think Pacquiao by that time will be too old and uh, Spence might stop him. Yeah. All right. Well, we cannot wait for Saturday night unification fight with uh, Maurice Hooker versus Jose Ramirez live on The Zone. Thank you so much, champ. Good luck on Saturday night. Thank you. Thank you. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you want to see more boxing coverage, make sure to subscribe by clicking right here. And don't forget to follow Fino Boxing on all our social media platforms.